back in pads and back to work. Training camp today starts now. Welcome into training camp today brought to you by Gillette. I'm Megan O'Brien. The Patriots were back out on the practice field today wearing full pads and the intensity ramped up just a bit. All eyes have been focused on the Patriots quarterback position. And it's clear from this camp that there's a competition, but one thing has stood out about Cam Newton, it's his energy. He approaches each day of practice with a vocal energy, and he's constantly encouraging his teammates and the offense when they make plays. The Patriots spent a significant amount of today's practice working on the running game. Rex Burkhead, Damian Harris, and James White have been the lead backs. Now we know the Patriots signed Lamar Miller, but we've yet to see him out on the practice field. He's still listed on PUP. But to me, Harris has been the guy who stood out. We saw little of him last season, but I expect him to be a guy to make a second year jump. There's no question that the deepest position on the Patriots roster is the cornerback position, and it showed up out on the practice field. Time after time, the defensive backs clearly have the advantage over the wide receivers, and that will certainly help the Patriots offense improve as they head into the regular season. Welcome on Patriots.com's Paul Perillo. Paul, we all know that last year there was clearly a problem with the weapons in terms of wide receivers. It's early, but what have been your impressions of that position? Yeah, I still think the defensive backs look a little bit better than the wide receivers. I think there's been some uh, trouble getting open consistently, but there have been a few guys that have sort of been some bright spots. Gunnar Olszewski is a guy to me that looks much improved from last year. Really quick in and out of his breaks. He consistently gets open. Devin Ross sent, spent some time last year on the practice squad. He looks much improved also, Megan. I think he's shown the ability to get open. And then the last guy is a new guy, Demir Bird. He could fly, and he is consistently down the field behind the defense. We have to get the quarterbacks up to speed with these guys, but once they start getting open, that's the number one problem. Get open. These three guys have been able to do that. I know just one is officially new to the Patriots, but the other two, some new faces here at Gillette. What type of impact can they make on the offense? Yeah, Jeff Thomas and Will Hastings, two lightning quick slot type kind of receivers. They just got on the practice field for the first time today. They look like their quickness could be a problem. We'll see what happens when they get up to speed. After practice, several Patriots met the media, including quarterback Brian Hoyer. Every day you're going out there to obviously perform the best you can, but also figure out, you know, what you have and what you can do. And so I think there's a lot of it um, that goes into it that is all right, we have this route. I have this guy on this route. This guy's covering him. I'm going to give him a chance on this route and see how it goes one way or the other. And that's how you learn. That's how you learn your teammates. That's how you learn um, their little nuances of how they run their routes. And obviously with the rotation, we're getting reps with everybody. So you're constantly going out there with new guys and you're just, you know, do what your coach to do. And then when you get a chance to throw to a guy, you're trying to, I guess, kind of build that rhythm or um, compatibility with him. And, and then you come back and watch it and learn from that. It's really exciting, especially because we didn't have the opportunity to do OTAs and mini camp and things like that. So you hadn't seen some of your guys for a long period of time. So getting back out there and seeing everybody, uh, that's a joy in itself. And then throwing on the pads, it's kind of like icing on the cake, uh, to be honest, because you just, you're just kind of excited. It's been a while. So we just knocked the dust off a little bit and we're excited about it. We'll do it from training camp today. We'll have all of your coverage tomorrow.